I go around for years to ILA how Linux is developed, mm -hmm. and part of it is showing who contributes, because mm -hmm. people want to know. And my main point of that is, when talking to companies, is do you, anybody can contribute. If mm -hmm. you rely on Linux, mm -hmm. um, shouldn't you help contribute to Linux if you want to make sure it goes in the way that's useful for you, mm -hmm. or do you trust these other companies? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's the best thing about Linux. Everybody can contribute it and drive it in the way they want to. Yeah. And um, Canonical's business decision is to not contribute. And that's fine. That's mm -hmm. perfectly valid, and we have no problem with it. Mm -hmm. um, and Canonical agrees with that. That's what they do. So there's not really any controversy. People uh, didn't, I don't think people realize that. That's all. Uh, has anything changed because they released their own catalog of, you know, supported uh, devices or supported uh, hardware catalog? And that's what the Linux kernel supports. It's no different from any other distro. Okay. So uh, um, they have contributed more. Mm -hmm. uh, I, there's no problem, question about that. But lots and lots of people contribute. Mm -hmm. They're just, they, they just aren't a major contrib contributor, contributor, which is fine. Mm -hmm. I have no objection to that.